Yo, fat man at the chop up out. Man, I'm sitting down with the coolest motherfucking guest yet, man. I got my dog Mickey Rollins in the building. Entrepreneur, fucking y'all see the spread, man. That's what it is, man. This is Fat Man to chop up out, Mickey. Yeah, Fat Man, what up? Thanks man? for coming through, bro. Man, you already know what it is, man. Hey, man, you, when, you, when you blew the whistle, man, I'm coming, man. Oh I'm my coming. God, bro. I ain't never heard it said like that. That's gang. Yeah, man. Niggas said nigga blew the whistle. Man, straight up, man. bro. Coming through, bro. Straight up, man. So yeah. what you got in front of us today, bro? Man, this some work, man. I got a whole bunch of love. You know what I'm saying? You see, okay. you know everywhere, man. Okay. Uh, you know, you see the drip. You That's know what I'm mean? saying? Yeah. The drip, real. Dope. Yeah, man. Dope, so, you know, man. A whole bunch of love, man. That's all I'm selling, man. What, what inspired this logo, me? Man, it's a couple of things inspired that, man. Uh, one was, uh, 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 it was a, uh, it was a shooting. It was a killing back. Uh, who was this guy? Who was this guy? You know, it was, a, it was a big march. I'm trying to think of, man, forgive me, forgive me, brother. Hey. Forgive me, brother. I know you done passed away, but uh, it, it was this guy that- uh, How that far killed. back, man? Yeah, a couple years ago, maybe like uh, five years ago. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it was, uh, I can't think of his name. Damn. It's, it's okay, brother. Yeah. Thought. It's okay, but, but uh, that's the- Yeah, it was the police, the police killed him. Okay. And uh, everybody was, you know, getting together, man, and marching and uh, everything. So I'm like, damn. I need something, man. Something inspired me. I wanted to do a shirt, man. And, okay. You know what I'm saying? And, and go to the city, man, and, and, and do it. Right. So I had drew this stick figure um, that had, you know, a, a stick man on it, and this had I had this, I drew this heart. Okay. This heart was really the first was it was a gunshot. Okay. To the heart. Okay. And I, I, I made it I made it a heart. Okay. So I, I sent it to my art dude. He came by my house. We sitting on the front porch, and I'm telling him, man, I said, listen, man, I really want to do this, man, and take these shirts up, man, and da 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 da. He said, Mick, man, that that damn logo, that that heart you drew on here, man, it's just so hard, man. You should put that on the shirt by itself, straight man. Straight up, straight up, straight up. Yeah, man. So straight you know, uh, yeah, man. And and I fucked around and put it on the put it on this hey, put man. the heart on Look the shirt, man. man. I, listen, I listen, I listen, I listen, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I listened. Hey, man. I did it, man, and you know that was history, man. And you know that's how it really came up, came about. You okay. know what I mean? Okay. And so I didn't have a name yet. I didn't have the company yet. I just okay. had something that was on my heart okay. that wanted me to, you know, what I'm saying, do okay. something and give back. But um, and um, fast forward, uh, was my, my I cut this I cut this dude, man, a very special friend of mine, man. Let me use his platform. His name is Rico Love. Okay. You know, a super producer. Ah, uh, yeah, I heard of him. Yeah, yeah, that's my homeboy, man. I've been cutting him for, you know, for some years, man. I've been cutting him for about six years. And uh, and uh, he, he gave me a platform, man. We were going on tour with Future. Okay. And, and uh, he, you know, he asked me to come out there with him. You okay. know what I'm saying? To cut his hair. Gotcha. And I, you know, I stepped to him and I said, listen, man, I'm, I'm a business man. I got a, I got a shop. I got things going on, man. Right. I'm a business man. I just can't just come out there just to cut your hair. Right. Even though that's the only hair I had to cut, man, and man was paying me like paying me like I was, you know, working in the shop cutting. That's what's, up. And that's what's up, bro. That's what's up. So I told him, I said, man, listen, if there's anything else I can do, man, because you know I'm a you know I'm a hustler. You know what I mean? He said, man, hey, you wanna um. Your merch you was allowed merch? back in? Y'all was the same? His merch. His merch, okay. Right. Okay. So he had his merch. So he asked me to come out there, work his merch, and just cut his hair. Okay. You know what I mean? Okay. And the nigga, you know what I'm talking about? The nigga paying me like, oh, I, I, shit, I only yeah. had to cut your hair? Yeah. One yeah. hand? You part of the carpet, nigga. Oh, man. I said, man, it's a blessing, man. So, you know, dude allowed me to go out there with him, man. We went on like a 40 some city tour with Future. Okay. So, uh, God damn, it was a blessing. Cities. Fuck. Yeah, man, we was everywhere, man. We was bouncing everywhere. About three months or so. That's what yeah, about yeah, about two and a half, three yeah, months. You know what I'm saying? Every day, yeah, every day, like you know. Every city, every day. Every day, man. God damn, bro. Yeah. That had to be that. That had to be something real special for you too, because you get to see a lot of places you probably would have never even known exist. Right, man. I, I mean, I went to all these cities. You know what I'm saying? Just bouncing around, man. Every city, every night, man. You know what I'm saying? On the tour bus. You know what I'm saying? You know. Eating and drinking the best. Eating, drinking, and everything else. Yeah. <laughs> and it was beautiful. It's great yeah. like that, man. Let's go. Smoking kill. all that, everything. All of that. Oh, yeah. nah, man. Oh, yeah. So, he allowed me to do that. I'm out there with Future. And uh, Future Camp was there. And I'm out, you know, we got two tables. So, it, you know, it, 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 in a venue, you know, and in a venue, you know, you, you got the Birch Station in the back. Okay. You know, the club or, the, um, you know, the venue. 
And I'm saying, man, Future, man, he, he, they pumping, they pumping out. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, damn, what he buying this shit? I had this shit, man. Yeah, yeah, merch more. Damn, t-shirts and shit. Yeah, he yeah. Out with bands. Yeah, yeah. On, on, on t-shirts, man. That's when you build your brand. Right, right. So, um, I'm sitting there and I'm like, man, we out here and we don't have no merch of our own. Right. Like, you know, like, I don't have no merch of my own. Gotcha. You know, we out here, you know, I'm like, damn. So, you know, the light kept hitting, hitting, hitting. I'm like, damn, man, if I had some shit, and, um, you know, if I had some shit to sell of right. my own, man, I, I could pump up. Right, right, right. You know right, what I'm saying? Right, right, right. So, it was a hat that we was, um, that we were selling that was going so so fast, man. It was, we couldn't even keep keep stocking this hat. This it was future shit. Uh, no, nah, it was shit. our shit. Okay. Yeah, but the hat was uh, called Save Art. It just was. It just said Save Art on it. Okay. Plain, simple, Save Art. Okay. Okay. And uh, and, and bro, I'm telling you, it that people was buying that fucking hat like a motherfucker and it just said save art so i found me going through these cities and everything that people was so in line with art man it's like it's a whole nother world out here that's big man art is like it's a whole nother it's a, it's a culture of its own better man. believe it it's it's big bro it's better like believe. you said we got winwood yeah it's a winwood in every city in every place it's a winwood and Fort Lauderdale, Miami, down south. It's a wing, it's a, it's yeah. a place that just scrape every, every, in every state. Every state, every city is four five places like that. You I know what I'm saying? I got you. So it's something that it, it hit me and I'm like, damn, art is so big. And um, so I'm sitting there, man, I had already had this vision with the whole thing. Right. For us, you know, the, 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 the heart and all that type of stuff. So I'm, I'm I'm, I'm going through every night. I'm just on the bus, taking drawing, notes, taking notes yeah. seeing what's happening. Yeah. You know. Yeah. And I'm like, damn, if I can find something that that, that evoke and, and uh, evoke an emotion. Okay. Like this hat. Gotcha. This save our hat. Man, I'm a win. Right, right, right. So I was trying to find something that had the word art in it. Okay. Like you know, I'm Dylan Davin. Art, 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 art. Yeah, I'm just thinking of all type of shit. And you know? when you speak on art, how to cut y'all, Nick? I had a guy through here, uh, Emmanuel, Emmanuel uh, George, uh, big art guy, big art guy. I had a guy here well last week. Matter of fact, he hit that stuff too. And I heard you just talking about Winwood just now. He part, he uh, the six strong over there. He done did a lot of festivals over there, yeah. and he in the art too. So yeah. when you talk about art, man, you say how big it is. He spoke about how big it really is, man. The black it's, art that with shit that we done created. Yeah, I'm telling you, man. You know, but everything is, is you know, you know, it's just, it's just, man, art is just big, bro. Right, you know. Anything that we have, anything that we see, you know, man, listen, that is big. It's, I get it's, it's it. Huge. I get it, bro. I get so, it. So, you know, you know, and going back to the story, I, I came up with the the true true heart, bro. Okay. Cause you know it started coming together, man. God started placing these things on, right, on my right. head, and I'm just like, yo, I got the, I got the logo, I got the name now. You know right, what I mean? Right. Let me put this thing together. Right, True. right, right. And it was a name that that it evoked an emotion of of it, of it, you know, by itself as well. Straight up. So I'm dibbling and dabbing, man, trying to draw logos and trying to draw this and that and that. And my homeboy Rico, man, uh, said to me, Hey. Look here, we'll be right back. This is Fat Man at the Chopper of Power, man. We'll fuck with you in a minute, man. We got Mickey Rollins in the building. Huh? Yo! We back at the Chopper of Power with Fat Man. We got my guy Mickey Rollins in the building, man. Black entrepreneur, man. Talk yeah, to us, man. bro. Yeah, man. You know, we just working, bro. You know what I mean? We just working, man. I see you got a whole spread, man. Shorts, shirts. Hats. Yeah, man. My nigga dropped me a couple pieces through here, man. True heart, man. Polo, sweatshirts, all that. We fucks with you, brother. So, yeah. I know, I know this. Your primary thing, you moving the brand. Yeah. The True Heart brand, which I think is a dope brand. Man. I see them everywhere, man. Before I actually met you, I used to see them on God. I just wonder where they come from. But then, through, through a mutual friend that we got. That's how I found out about you. Right, right. And uh, uh and you as a matter of fact, the first day that I came to your video shoot, you threw me a t shirt, man, and I really appreciated that, man. And yeah, uh, yeah, for sure, uh man. that was all love and I and I and I just wanted to tell you thank you. Hey man. For that, man. Since it's love, bro. But but I know you say you cut how your barb, you was cutting for what the artist 
uh, Rico. Rico Love. Uh, yeah. Rico Love, man. So yeah, he's one of my, yeah, he's one of my, uh, one of my, you know, good friends that I that I cut, man. I've been cutting, I've been cutting uh, up here um, for like since what '97. So I've been cutting up here for about 22, 23 years. Twenty-two man. years. Yeah, man. So God I, damn, I, hey, man. <laughs> Hey, hey, make you look a day over 20, man. Man, When hey. you say that, man, the big nigga like, hey, how old this nigga is, man? Hey, that's, 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 that's one of the mother gifts, God. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Keep me young, keep me youthful, hey, keep me hip, man. Keep it's me working. wavy. It's working. You know what I mean? It's working, My bro. kids, man. I got I got 27 year old kids, man. Real shit. Yeah, man. God damn, you know what bro. Mean? Keep me wavy, man. Hey, man. <laughs> hey, hey, they keep you on top of the game, though, bro. Keep it really do, bro. Game, bro. Keep you young spirited, bro. Yeah. Keep it, keep man. That's a beautiful thing. Cutting twenty plus years. Yeah. Where your barber shop located at? Yeah, over off Sunrise, man. Uh, right across the street from uh, Carter Park. What's the address? Uh, uh, thirteen ninety five West Sunrise Boulevard. Okay. It's right between Burger King and Popeyes. It's a plaza that sit right in between that, man. You can't miss it. It's called Star Island Salon. You know what I mean? So I done had that salon like twenty years. Twenty right? years. So 20 you years. say salon? That's unisex. Yeah, unisex. It's unisex. I got a. I got my own private little spot, you know, that I okay. cut private, private okay. little spot, man. And, um, yeah, so, you know, I've been doing that for a minute. Okay. Yeah. Hey, the man says unisex. So bring your little girl through, y'all. Yeah, man. Man, they you. fucking with you, man. They gonna keep yeah. you. I got your bump, you have your right, have everything right when you leave them out that bitch, man. Nails, all that. Everything oh, my God. Man. Niggas say they doing pet. The man say they doing pedicures, man. Thing, Straight up, bro. Hey, man, I hate yeah, man. Nigga, your hustle is like no other. For what I'm listening to right now, your hustle is like no other, Mickey. Man, I, you know, I got a, you know, I, I got a, you know, a little team, man. My, my brother, man, my brother uh, Byron, Byron Trice, man, clean face management, man. Okay. And uh, you know, that's another thing that you know that we're involved in. You know, what market? Uh, well, uh, management. Okay. Yeah, yeah, management, man. We got a management company called uh, Clean Face. Clean, clean face, face Management. Yeah. So um, you know we manage uh, uh ball greasy. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, likes of uh, Glock Nine. Okay. Um, you know. Okay. Okay. Artists, you know what I'm saying? Man, that's beautiful, bro. Yeah, man. So we, we just booking. You know, the pandemic kind of got everything. Uh, yeah, tangling, dangling, 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 dangling up. I, I get it, man. Yeah. That's what inspired me to do this, man. I said it's down time. I ain't got inspired. I was looking at somebody else's podcast, and you know they said, man, do some of this time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's time where everything all fucked up, man. Find your road, find your route, man, and ride it, man. You know what I mean? So, yeah. you know, it's a beautiful thing, yeah, man. So, man. I seen what, this this bottle of, what's this, cognac or wine or yeah, champagne? It's, 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 it's some wine, man, some sparkling wine, man. It's called Wifey, man. Uh, another one of my good friends, uh, one of my clients, okay. a dude named uh, James James Lindsley, man. He okay. uh, owned a company, man. It's called Rap Snack, and I know y'all familiar with that. Oh, y'all see definitely. the boozy chips and strainer chips and all okay. that type of stuff. Okay. Uh, yeah, man. So you know he got his champagne, man. So everywhere I go, I you know that, that's that's my brother, man. I show him love and you Straight know up. and uh, up. Man, up. it's it's some it's some it's some nice nice tasting champagne, Straight man. Up, man. Straight up, and, man. Uh, it's called well, what where did you go find it at? Man, uh, shit, he, he he just dropped it. It's cool ball, so, too. Yeah, yeah, he just dropped it, man. So you're gonna be seeing it everywhere, man. It's probably gonna be Walmart and all, man. Okay. Right now, he got his chips in over 40, uh, over 40 something hard. I, I see him everywhere, man. All the corner stores everywhere, man. So, oh, bro. You no, know, bro, man, that nigga, you know, he, 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 he inspired me to do what I do, man. It's like cats like that I'm around, man, that, uh, you know, I see him once a week. He's, he's, he's like a mentor to me. Okay. And uh, I pick his brain. Cause he's a marketing genius. I always do that. I pick his brain every week, man. You gotta believe it. Even when he don't know I'm picking his brain, I pick his brain. He be like, he, he walk out, he like, nigga, this nigga just pick my brain. I pick, I'm gonna pick Bro. the shit out your brain. I'm gonna ask you a thousand questions. Never be afraid to stop murdering. You know what I mean? The man, the man, you know, it's a multi-millionaire off of snacks, man. Yeah, I believe it. It's a multi-millionaire off of off snacks. Ain't not one gas station I walk in that ain't in there, man. Yeah, man, so. You know, that type of stuff inspired me, man, to know that, you know, when I go to his crib, when I see how he's living, you know what I mean? I see, you know, it, yeah. it's, it's possible. It's you possible. You know what I mean? It's possible. You know, he just like me, me and you, you yeah. know what I mean? So, believe it, bro. You know, it just, hey, it's, you know, that inspiration just rub off, man, and uh, and I hope one day I can be as, you know, inspirational and as inspiring or, you know, as he is to me, to someone else. You're ahead of the curve already, yeah, baby. Man. I'm here to tell you, you're ahead of the curve, bro. That's what it be about, man. You're ahead of the curve, bro. I, you hey, man, we're watching what you do, watching what you got going on. Yeah, That's man. inspiring to some man, young brothers, bro. Man. I, I, I've been at this a long time, man. I get it. This ain't like really just come overnight. 
you know, I've been at this man since uh, probably like 94, 95, man. Yeah, damn, I've been bro. talking about t-shirts and marketing type of stuff. I've been trying to sell okay. something okay. from back when. God damn, bro. You know what I'm saying? So you, right now you're seeing the product of it, but you know, it's 15, 20 years, 20 some years that okay. I've really been, you know, trying to make something happen and I learning. Guess. I'm learning the game, so you know, it, and it don't stop. It don't stop. Yeah, so, so I, I just figured another five years from now, shit. Hey man, you'll be where you want to be. I, 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 I gonna, hope I'm gonna bless that on your I, life, man. Yeah, no, 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 for real, man. I, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yo, yo, straight up, bro. Yeah, man. Hey man, I did. Man, it's inspiring you sitting down with you, man. I feel like I'm sitting with uh, greatness, bro. Yeah, man. You understand what I'm saying? It, man, I you, appreciate it, bro. You say you got a, a son? Are you 27? Yeah, well, I got a, uh, my daughter. I got a, I got a 27, uh, 23, and uh, 20. 20, okay. And, yeah, I got God two damn. daughters and a son. My son, 20, man. Uh, okay. I put it, you know, and I shed. Yeah, and that, that's that's something that that's something that's amazing to me as well, man. No doubt. That it, you know, off of cutting hair yeah. and my hustling, man. I don't put kids through college, man. My son, he's in college damn. now. You know what I mean? Yeah, what college you at? He, uh, he had, he had, a, he had a, at a prep school right now um, uh, in, in uh, Indiana. Indiana, okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. he played ball. Beautiful thing, yeah, man. He that basketball, Beautiful man. thing, man. Yeah, my daughter, man, she just graduated from LSU about okay. two years ago. Okay, got down. It's a big college, yeah. bro. Yeah, man. You big know? college, but I hey. know. I got a kid I put through school, too, man, so I know that shit is expensive. That's college shit. Know, expensive man. than a motherfucker, man. Yeah. But hey, we're going to get right back at it in a few minutes, man. This is Fat Man with the Chop Up Out. I'm in this motherfucker with Mickey Rollins, nigga. Y'all fuck with him, nigga. Yeah. Hey, man, we back, man, at the Chop Up Out. Yo! Y'all fuck with us, man. Mickey Rollins in the building, man. Brother, man, I tell you, man, behind the scenes, man, you a very interesting, articulate, and entrepreneur type ass dude, man. Yeah, man, you know, I got some travels, you know what I mean? Yeah. We all got some travels, but, uh, yeah, man, you know. Hey, man, I, 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 I'm inspired I, I, by you, brother. Hey, man, I appreciate it. Bro. I'm inspired brother, man, by you, brother. I know you spoke about the barbershop, the unisex salon, and and fucking your merchandise, man, that you move here today, which I feel like is, man, is top-notch merchandise, bro. I, I, I can't even tell you no doubt, no lie, man. I'm, yeah. I'm a fan, bro. I appreciate it, man. I'm a fucking fan, brother. Yeah, man. We working hard, man. Trying to put this thing together, man. You know? That's what's up, bro. Yeah. That's yeah. what's up. Where you, where you go from here, man? Other than endeavor that you roads that you want to travel down and you think about traveling down? Well, you know, this this, this is my baby, man. I got to see this thing, be, you know, be, uh, to, to its fullest potential. You know what I mean? Most definitely. So, uh, you know, I'm just steady working, man, trying to build this brand, man. Okay. And, um, hopefully, you know, preferably, you know, uh, one day, man, I can I can be in the likes of um, of um, of um, you know some some top notch um, designs. Uh, you know, it's some top notch stores. You know what I mean? I got you. Yeah, I got you. Yeah, that's where I'm really trying to go, man. Hey, man. You know, it's a lot of cats. Uh, you know, they're trying to push me, push me into you know a lot of um, local you know um, hip hop stores. I got you. And, uh, it's I, bigger than that, though. Yeah, I'm just, I be kind of reluctant, man, because I, like I say, man, I'm just a, a student of the game, man, and uh, and I and I'm, I'm learning where cats fail, you know, where they fail right. at, right, right, you know, where they win at, and right, where they fail at, right, so, right. You know, I'm trying to win, no doubt. Yeah, so I don't want to no mud it out. I don't want to oversaturate the hood. And, you set them out for the end. You set them out for the end, man. Yeah. You see, you set them out for the end, bro. Yeah, and that's how you do it, man. That, you mud it out. Saturated, exactly. it's just gonna water down yeah. like flea market. Exactly. Now, yeah, exactly. Now you can't get into those big stores. You yeah. can't get into the to the Macy's and the, yeah. and the big markets and the Bloomingdale. Yeah. 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 So I'm trying, I, to, trying I, to get another Nemus, man. I'm trying no to get doubt. Nemus, man. I watched the story on that guy Carl Canal too, man. He spoke exactly what you said right now. He tried to stay away from certain things yeah, in the man. beginning because he tried to, you know. Try to get you try to drive that boat in a different direction, man. And you know, I think uh, from what I from what I read about him, he done started some other shit out here in California now. He's doing something else now. Yeah, I don't know. yeah, he 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 he's a he's a super inspiration, man. I I, I studied I studied that cat as well. Okay. You know what I mean? Uh, okay. Uh, Damon, man, I study him as well, bro. And um and um. You know, he, he's a, uh, he got a, a, a plethora of uh, knowledge, y'all. Yes. You know what I mean? Yes. And, uh, yes. 
He has the souls and everything. I see he runs soul machines, he, all kind of shit. He own a lot of brands, bro. Real he shit. He buy brands. Wow. So a lot of stuff that you see, man, this dude probably own the brand, you know what I mean? He That's just running through it. Ain't just car, that man own a lot of stuff, man. Echo, he own a lot of, he own Okay. Lot. Yeah, so dude is, you know, he, you gave me some game just then, man. Yeah, he's super, he's super on top of that game, man. Yeah, he gave me some game just then. Yeah, I ain't, sure. ain't not to throw, take it too far, of course, but I was looking at an uh, interview the other day where the young cat Dream, mm -hmm. the, the, the nigga owned like 11 motherfucking Popeye's chickens. Who knew? That's why we don't see no music no more from the guy. The guy that Dream, 11 Popeye's, he say, he say Burger King actually owned Popeye's. Who knew that? I didn't know that I either. Didn't know that I, either. I, I, fuck, I was new to me, man. So that's why he said he ain't really been on that music shit. He yeah. said, nigga, I been on the golf course now, nigga. Hey, man, once you figure it out, man, once you tap in, man, and get yeah. into them, them right circles. That's what I said. You'll, you know, you'll learn that type of stuff and be around that, that type of success. Right. Man, you'll figure out. Yeah. Hey, this yeah. make money. Yeah. Them dudes. <laughs> <laughs> Those dudes different right now. Those different right they now. They different. You know what I mean? Straight up, bro. Yeah. That's what it be about, man. Straight up, man. Yeah, hey, sir. Hey, Mick, how could they fire you on the social media world, man? Yeah, what people man. that want to know? Yeah, I got, um, you know, I'm on IG. You know, you can check me out, man. I'm True Hard Coat. That's T R U H E A R T C O. And, um, you know, my website is uh, truehard.bigcartel.com. Straight up. Yeah, you know what I mean? You can get this merch, man. I can... Shout out. You know what I mean? Shout out. You can get it. Boy, just bless me. Yeah, man. He blessed it, man. Yeah, I got some new drip, man. You know what I mean? He blessed it, man. We just working, man. We just working, man. We just trying to build this brand, man. You man, know you what I'm doing a hell of a job at it, bro. You yeah. doing a hell of a job at it, bro. Yeah. You know, before I go, man, I want um, I want everybody to to uh, to read. Oh, this camera. Right I want everybody to, to to check this book out, man. It's called The Tipping Point. Right there. This down. this book. This book really changed my life. You know what I mean? It's called the Tipping Point. Man, it, it, it show you how how things become popular. You know what I'm saying? It's not by mistake. It's not by some accident. It's not by it's 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 it's, it's a it's a system. It's something that's in place that make that become popular. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and everything you know, this book is like it's all you know, the Man. So I look it up in a way. I'm big yeah. on books. I'm glad you brought the conversation to books, man. Cause I just finished uh, uh the spook that sat by the front door. I just finished that today. Yeah. Yeah. Man, I've been got finally got so heavy on books. I'm glad you drove with that direction, cause nigga, I done Oh man, in last last month, man, I got ran through like five, six books, man. I just recently, I finished uh, a couple weeks ago. I finished the Ross book. Yeah. I finished I the fucking uh, yeah. Kevin Hart book. I yeah, finished the. Ross the book is, is, yeah, is, that's is, a dope like, book, man. That book that will help me captivate it, nigga. I couldn't yeah. even start. I couldn't turn it off. I tell you, it's a couple books on the nightstand that I read, man. Just like when I read it's the Bible, it's Ross book, Straight up. Tipping Point. You know what I okay. mean? Okay. Okay. Some some books out there, man. That's just the Tipping yeah. Point. Yeah. So cats really need to be, you know, on that man. That Ganged you know, up. Get your get your reading on, man. Yeah, hey, amen. You man. gotta learn, man. You never can't stop learning. You can't man. stop learning. You know I mean? The minute you stop learning, you might well pull it, pull it right yeah, here, dog. Man. Yeah, man. Can't stop, man. Nigga told too me much money out here, man. It's too much money out and here, and it's man. in the books. It is. <laughs> They say you wanna hide something from a nigga, put it in a book. It's in the book. The nigga say you want a nigga, put it in a book. Niggas don't read much. But they got that audible out there now. They got that audible. They got that audible. You ain't gotta even pick the book up. You just hit the motherfucking button on the phone and listen to the book, nigga. You don't just read it, study it. It's exactly. You know what I mean? It's exactly. Study, soak up the game, soak up all the knowledge and, and wisdom yeah. that's got to offer, bro. Yeah, man. I'm sure, here to man. tell you, man. I'm new to this shit, though, too. That book, get that book, man. That the book, tipping book, point. Man, that, that book is, uh, it's, it's just it's just so inspirational, man. Okay. And it showed me, it just opened my eyes to everything that exists. Okay. Okay. That's popular. Right. So when I see it, I'm just like, damn, damn, it's a machine behind that shit, man. It's something, it's something that makes it. Yeah, and it's a science to what they do. God damn, bro. And I just be trying to follow the science, bro, on my level. Right. Because you know it's a big machine that's, right. that's handling, that's doing a right. lot of stuff that making. You know, people driving yeah. people certain directions. Right. All right. I read a book. I forgot the name of the title of the book. Spoke on that too. People want to be. People want to be. People want something to follow. Yeah. And it's people out there to create things that's gonna create people to follow. Basically, coming back to the biblical days when the sheep herder herded the sheep. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, sure. 
So this shit deeper than what we might think or what might know, but people want to be led, man. Be led. And it's, it's leaders out there and it's followers out there. Just always remember that. Yeah. It's leaders out there. This nigga right here is a fucking leader. He just gave you a big game just now. Yep, and it's buyers and sellers. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not forget about that. You know what I mean? Hey, man. You know what I mean? Well, think about it, bro. That's what I'm talking about, yes, man. Hustlers. <laughs> and hustle. Hey, man. Straight up, <laughs> bro. Call it what it is, man. Call it what it is, man. Call it what it is, man. What, what, what side you want to sit on? Exactly. Let's sit on the bro. paper side, man. Yeah, that's man. what I'm talking that's about, what, man. That's all we're doing, man. Trying to, trying to you know, build this wealth up, man, so we can take care of our family, man. That's all it be about, man. Another day, bro. And, 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 and legacy. And legacy. That's it, And bro. legacy. Legacy is bigger than money to it's me. It's bigger than me, too. Me, too, that's, bro. That's, that's everything. Me, man. too, bro. Yeah. Me, too. Open it's book, legacy, bro. bro. Open Legacy. book, bro. How to create something, man, and drive it, man. And that way the kids got something to fall back on kids. when it's all said and done. Grandkids. When I'm gone, this supposed to still be pumps. Straight you know like I mean? that, bro. You building still it right pump. now. You building it. I'm building it. Yeah, you building it, man. That's yeah. what's happening, man. It's yeah. the motherfucker Chop Up Owl. Chop Up Owl. With motherfucker Mickey Rollins. Yeah, man. You hey. already know, hey, man. man. We appreciate him coming smoke, through, man. man. Y'all uh, fuck with him. How do you find one more time, Mick? Man, you find me True Hard, man. True Hard Co. T R U H E A R T C O. You hit me on that, that's that IG. Straight and, up. And, and then that website, man, truehard.bigcartel.com. Man, get on there, get you some of this, man. Get you some of this you better drip, believe it. man. Get you some of this, man. The drip is for real, man. You better believe it. And we working, and we gonna keep dripping. We gonna keep dripping. There it is. You know what I mean? Hey, Mick. You already know. I appreciate name. you coming through. The yeah. chop up out with Fat Man, Mickey Rollins, we in the building, man. Love we out this motherfucker. Huh? There it is.